make yourself at home. Are you sure? What will it be, dear? What will it be, dear? Denim, dear, I find myself in a spot of trouble. I was hoping you might... No, <laughs> but I wouldn't want to inconvenience you. You started this. Finish what you meant to say. No, no, no. I'm not in the habit of imposing on others. The one who spilt the brew should mop it up. Forget I said anything. Off with you now. Ta-ta! No, oh, let's hear it. Perhaps I can help. I wouldn't ask that much. It's a nuisance, really. A nuisance? Tell me what it is, and I'll be the judge of that. I shouldn't want to be obliged to you, dear. A young lady should never let herself feel obliged. She's right about one thing. This is a nuisance. Cute, but slow, this one. A girl likes a man with a strong, firm hand. You should, uh, speak to yourself more quietly. Oh, my lips betray me. <sighs> say what you have to say. Oh, I haven't upset him, have I? My dear little goose. I heard that as well. Spit it out, would you? Ahem. Yes, well, I am a witch, as you know. Which are which, it's all the same. The pointy hat rather gave it away. And as a witch, I find myself dabbling in a great deal of magic, always concocting something new. Trouble, most like. But if it weren't for this meager shop, I'd scarce have enough money to eat. The shop thrives. Perhaps she's a spendthrift. There is that, yes. 
<clears throat> I needed someone to help me around the shop. And you thought to ask me? Oh, you have the war to deal with. I wouldn't think of troubling you with something so trivial. <sighs> That's why I decided to make a servant. Make a servant? Something I could manipulate with magic. A mindless golem. Clay golems are positively medieval, so I used a pumpkin instead. You made a golem out of a pumpkin? Well, where is it? I don't see any pumpkin golem. Oh, so quick to find fault. You may think I failed, but I never fail. <sighs> the animation went perfectly, but it was, after all, a pumpkin. And apparently, pumpkins make for poor servants. So it was a failure. What was that? <clears throat> I didn't say anything. You're sure? I wouldn't want to make me angry if I were you. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the pumpkin. <sighs> they said I wasn't paying them enough. And they quit. What paying them enough? But they're golems. <clears throat> I pride myself on attention to detail. I needed proper servants, so I made them as lifelike as possible. I gave them wills of their own. In other words, a failure. Mm, I didn't catch that. So, um, where are these pumpkin golems now? Well, they tried to rob me, but I am an accomplished spellcaster. I taught them a lesson they won't forget. And they fled screaming from my shop. Exactly how many are we talking about? Hmm. I lost count. I have been known to get a little carried away. W where are they? Well, that's just the trouble. They were quite intent on being paid, you see. They're ransacking the village for coin. This is starting to sound like more than a nuisance. You see? I can't help but feel partly responsible. What? Partly? So why haven't you done anything about it? They're in a frenzy. I can't handle them alone. Why do I get the feeling she's enjoying this? Never. But I do need your help, dear. Stay out of my thoughts, if you don't mind. So, wait. All this was to ask me to help you exterminate some pumpkins? Yes, I suppose it was. I'd be ever so grateful. Are you going to tell me where they are? Oh, yes. Their leader called herself Pumpkin, a thick-rinded, particularly insolent creature. She said she wanted to become human. Why would she want to do that? Oh... I said something to the effect that only humans were paid for their labor. Pumpkin must have taken that to heart. Or to seed. Seeds. Whatever. I'm starting to feel sorry for the pumpkins. Come again? I said I feel sorry for the pumpkins. No sympathy for poor Deneb. I feel a tear running down my cheek. Ugh, this is getting old. Ahem. <clears throat> When Pumpkin asked me how she could become human, I told her some relic of the Dragon Lords might make it possible. I don't believe this. Come again? Then they're headed for the Palace of the Dead. Precisely! I will accompany you, of course. I wouldn't think of asking you to go alone. I will have to close the shop, but... It should be worth it for our romantic getaway. Uh, as if the pumpkin golems weren't enough.
they're everywhere. Oh, don't look so grim. Take down Pumpkin and the rest should go quietly. Wh which one's Pumpkin? They all look the same. Pumpkin! Pumpkin! You can come out now. Mummy's not upset with you anymore. Hmm, nothing. That's strange. I wonder where she's gone. They seem docile enough now. Maybe we can simply ask them to come back. Huh. It's worth a try. Pumpkin! Pumpkin! Mummy's brought you your allowance. Still not biting. Pumpkin doesn't want allowance. Pumpkin wants real money. She's here. I told you, Pumpkin. Only people get paid to work. That's my position and I'm sticking to it. She's nothing if not stubborn. But Pumpkin is a people! How... how is this possible? Ugh. This isn't funny, Pumpkin. If you mean to challenge me, you're in for a rude awakening. I don't know what sort of glamour this is, but get rid of it this instant. Pumpkin could do that, but Pumpkin thinks you will be sorry. I've been patient, but enough is enough. We'll see how insolent you are when you're baking in a pie dish. Come, Denim, let us show her who she's up against. How did I get myself into this?
to be treated like everybody else. Why not give her a second chance, Deneb? The village isn't too badly damaged, really. Spare the rod, spoil the pumpkin, Denim. You said yourself that you needed someone to help out. If you leave Pumpkin to tend the shop, you could even... Well, you could even come with us. <gasps> that sounds like a proposal. What do you say, Pumpkin? <gasps> How rude. Pumpkin will get paid? And others too? I am the shop's proprietress, so I'll need a fair split of the profits. Say, 70%? Ooh, splitting hairs, more like. True. A proprietress deserves her share. Still... 20%! Not shy, is she? 50%. 30! 40, and that's my final offer! Thirty-five! What have I started? Have to have the last word, eh? Fine, thirty-five, but you'll pay the others out for your end. Deal! And don't go forgetting who your master is. <laughs>